A storm is headed our way, and we're not talking about exactly what you may be thinking. Yeah, there's potential severe weather is on the way, but also a geomagnetic storm that's expected to impact us tomorrow. Storm Team meteorologist Rachel Dunsing has more. A few days ago, space weather forecasters saw this eruption from the surface of the sun. It doesn't look all that impressive, but then something else happened. So we had one eruption early on the 28th of March, and that was headed towards Earth, and now we've had a second eruption behind that one. And so these two are combined now and both heading towards Earth. But before you freak out, Rob Steenberg, a space scientist at the Space Weather Prediction Center, says while this is a strong geomagnetic storm. So on the one to five scale right now, we've got a forecast out for tomorrow of G3. Most people won't notice impacts. These storms happen when the magnetic field of a solar flare interacts with Earth's magnetic field. It sounds complex and maybe a little concerning, but the storm isn't strong enough to cause infrastructure issues. However, if you rely on GPS or use radio communication, expect some disruptions. We let airlines know, uh, people who use uh, high frequency radios for communications, we let them know. Uh, so there's a variety of customers um, mm -hmm. that, we, uh, that we interact with to help them prepare for these occasions. While a geomagnetic storm won't have an impact on your cell phone, as we rely on more technology, space weather affects us, even if we don't notice. You know, space weather is, is becoming more impactful to society. And so NOAA and the Space Weather Prediction Center, you know, that's our role is to be America's source for those watches, warnings, and alerts. Meteorologist Rachel Dunzing, CBS 17.